Here we see the trigger level for signal. The trigger level is indicated here on the right. Notice the signal isn't moving back and forth on the screen, but once the trigger level moves outside of the signal, we notice the signal moves because it can't trigger. When we move the trigger level down inside, then we'll see that the signal will stop moving. As we move the trigger level up and down within the signal, we'll see the signal moves back and forth, but it doesn't keep moving. Once we move outside, either above or below the signal, then the signal isn't triggered, and so it moves constantly.